Good morning, something's gonna happen on this roof today. And it's also my birthday, so it's a really nice gift. I'm getting a solar system! My friends, look what this is in the background. I'm so happy. We just got back from the shop to pick up two more panels and I'm so excited. Unfortunately, now I'm alone, so I just need to store them into the shed somehow. So beautiful. some parts. This is where the placa will be installed and I just need to clean these stairs a little bit. Okay, now I'm ready. This is the roof. We're gonna put the panels up. We're gonna have to climb on the roof. But yeah, this is the roof. I stored the panels in the next stone house. Yay, the electrician is here. So we need to get the wood out so we can install the rackets on the concrete beams. This is so much fun! It doesn't make sense to keep them because the roof needs to be insulated before the wood comes. So I'm trying not to break them. My first time on this roof. Luckily, it's not very steep. Number one is done. The first one of eight. There was poop on this wooden cladding and it was so disgusting. That was not so nice, being sprayed by poop on my birthday. And yes, I know, I should have worn a mask. Here goes number two. And the nice thing about the rack system is that you don't need to screw through your roof.
So now he's putting up the racks, two racks with four pieces and then it's time for the panels, hopefully soon. Wow, the last panel is on the roof. The electrician really worked so hard and I'm so glad. So time to celebrate my birthday. So yesterday we celebrated, had very good cake. And I got three trees as a present. I'm so happy, especially this one I'm very excited about. A blood orange and a lemon, which is already very tall. And another little lemon. It's raining again. And now we are going to continue with the solar system and hopefully gonna finish it today. I'm so excited. <laughs> Guten Morgen! And this is the battery. And there's so many cables. But there's now a problem. We don't know how many cables need to be connected to this battery. So he needs to find out and it's still raining. This is so annoying because he needs to go on the roof and it's too dangerous when it's wet like this. While the electrician was connecting all the parts, I did a little sidekick and started cleaning this wall. Unfortunately, the rain kept coming, so the electrician left for the day. I was very sad that we couldn't finish it, so I could practice my patience. Another night by candlelight and my little solar lamp. It's been quite cold and windy, so I'm heating now. In the middle of June in Portugal, this is just amazing. It's a beautiful morning. Finally, no rain anymore. Good morning, bon dia. Today is day number three for the solar system. Fingers crossed that today we can connect it and I will have some power here. It feels like such an ordinary thing, but at the same time, such a special and incredible thing. So the electrician is positive that we can finish it today. Yay! Mm. So I'm just starting to remove all the plants and brambles here that are growing by the house. And it's like really fertile soil because always the water is dripping there.
So this is where the cables go outside on the wall and then down into this roof. Well, now it shouldn't rain because I opened the wound to the house even more. But it's not gonna rain now, I think. So that's good. So we are now updating the software for the servo. And the panels are already producing power now. Da 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 da! The battery is charging now. Everything is working now. It's so crazy. And here's where the tension can go into the ground. It's a magic moment. Now we're gonna put the power line down to the cabin. Let's go, let's get some power to this tiny house. Mr. Cowboy, a brand new fresh cable. So I changed my mind to put the cable not down here, but rather on this line because here also the a future water pump might need electricity on this line here so power line will go in here into the cabin So this plug, the first plug for the house, just didn't work. So now we have to take another plug and it's almost six. We're really just exhausted. So after two days of fighting with the system, it's finally done. The third day made it work. Tonight I can for the first time plug in the lamp. So it will be possible to work. Let me show you how it was before. So I have one power bank. Whenever my camera phone and my normal phone would be dead, I would plug them into this or in a cafe or in the car. So it was really annoying because every time I had to edit, I needed to go somewhere. So it was a lot of driving in the end. I'm so looking forward to be able to edit the videos here, to take my time, to have a quiet place. So on the roof there are four panels with 400 watt each. So I have 1600 watt in the peak. The inverter has a three kilowatt power. Right now I have one battery of 2.4 kilowatt hours a lithium battery it took quite some time to figure out what i want what i need now i changed from two panels to four panels and i'm super happy with it and let's see how it works i got this lamp as a birthday present This evening is so much longer now because I just have some light. I'm making my new calendar, very basic. Just some paper and sewing it together. The first night with power in my house. I'm gonna remember this forever. June 14th, 2023. <laughs> what a difference this little box can make. It's just amazing. With electricity, it's the first time I can work in the cabin for more than like two hours. Yay!